uh, Rob Neuenschwander, week nine, uh, AK video. So uh, first I'm gonna have the patient lay uh, supine in a Superman position, and I'm gonna be checking the neck extensors. This is associated with the lumbar spine. So I want you to extend. All right, I'm gonna apply pressure. I want you to hold your neck. Oh, good, it's five out of five, relax. Um, now I'm gonna check the uh, um, right rotation with extension. This is gonna be checking the right SI. So go ahead and extend back, rotate right, hold. It's a five out of five. And go ahead and rotate to the left, hold. That's a five out of five. And that's checking the left SI. Now we're gonna check the sacrum. So same test, but we're gonna go left and right. So extend, hold, five out of five. And hold, five out of five. Okay. Um, now we're gonna be checking the uh, TL junction. Um, I want you to bring this arm out. We're gonna have thumb up and we're looking for the approximately the angle of uh, the TL intersection. So I want you to hold strong, hold. All right, it's a five out of five. Um, now we're gonna check uh, the middle delt for the CT junction. I'm gonna try to bring your arm down this way, so I want you to hold strong, hold. Uh, it's a five out of five. And then uh, glute max, this is gonna be checking the upper cervical. So bring your leg up, hold right there. Now fist on the sacrum. Hold, it's a five out of five. Um, Popliteus, I'm gonna put the patient into internal rotation. Um, this is checking the lower cervicals. So hold, all right. And then the last one, go ahead and flip over. I'm gonna be doing the psoas muscle check, or muscle test. This is associated with the uh, occiput natus. So I'm gonna bring the patient's leg up, externally rotate, and stabilize the opposite ASIS, hold. That's a five out of five. All right, the last fixation scan is the Terry's Major. I want you to patient make two fists and put them on the small of your back right here and bring your elbows up towards the ceiling and hold. All right, that's a four out of five uh, bilaterally, which means the thoracics are involved. Um, so put these back. And now step one, I'm gonna be identifying the stack. So just finding an area um, that's not moving and there's one right here so this is uh, T3, T4, T5, T6 as well and T7 is also not moving. T8's moving well so this, my stack is 5, 6, and 7. I'm going to go to the superior most vertebra, go out to the TVPs and locate posterior order. So for him it's on the right side, T5 uh, right TVP is most posterior, most restricted. Um, after I've done that, I'm gonna come into the lamp head junction and apply uh, S or I to S pressure. And also the right side is, is restricted. So that's telling me that um, the right, I need to adjust uh, on the T5 and then the left on the T6. And if it was the opposite, it would be the bottom two of the stack. So take a breath in and out. A syncopated adjustment posterior side first and retest so make two fists put them on the small of your back elbows up hold and it's a five out of five uh, this is the back scan we're going to start with the <laughs> rectus abdominis so i'm going to stabilize the patient's leg lean them back 30 degrees and hold okay go ahead and turn to your left this is going to be the uh, right external oblique uh, the left internal hold turn the other way so left external right internal hold okay go ahead and slide back to the end of the table point the patient's legs uh, to his left this is going to test the left ql stabilize the trochanter hold okay rectus femoris hold right there hold all right uh, this is the iliacus i'm going to turn the patient's foot out stabilize asis Hold, okay, so the psoas, bring the leg out, stabilize, hold, uh, sartorius, bend the knee, I'm gonna be pushing down on the knee and up on the ankle, hold, okay, gracilis, toe in, I'm gonna try to separate your legs, hold, okay, adductor, toe straight up, hold, okay, uh, glute medius, foot off the table, toe in, hold, and TF, TFL, uh, leg out, hold. Okay, go ahead and flip over. It's gonna be the medial hamstring. 
Um, so strain the medial fibers, pull it out, pull, okay, lateral hamstring, pull it in, pull, uh, bicep femoris is just straight away, hold, okay, piriformis, stabilize next to the patient's knee. I'm going to try to bring your leg outside, so hold, good job, all right, glute max, leg up, hold right there, stabilize sacrum, hold, Okay, and then super uh, sacrospinalis, bring this shoulder up, stabilize the sacrum, and I'm applying a stress in that direction. Hold, okay, bring your shoulder down a little bit. Hold, okay, shoulder down a little more. Hold, and all tests were five out of five. Uh, these are the muscle tests of the foot and ankle. First, I'm gonna check the tibialis anterior. So hold right there, hold. All right, tibialis posterior. Hold, okay. Uh, peroneus longus and brevis, hold. All right, and peroneus tertius, hold. All right, can you slide back just a little bit? Uh, this is gonna be the gastroc. So patient's, well, patient's leg extended, and go ahead and plantar flex, and hold, good. And now for the soleus, uh, go ahead and bend the knee, plantar flex, and hold. It's a foot and ankle, hold my dude.